Hello friends, welcome to CSOP Space. Today in this video session, we will discuss about how to export uh, data into Excel format with uh, header and footer in SP.NET Core. Uh, so let's start. We open our Visual Studio, and here I uh, already uh, create one sample project with simply fetching the record uh, from database. So simply run this application and uh, pressing Ctrl F5. So this simply fetching the record from uh, imply table record for the difference. Uh, uh, details that presented to the employee table. So uh, I am adding uh, one functionality here for exporting the details into the Excel format. So I am creating one method for this. So public I action result and I name this method as a export Excel and then uh, again fetching uh, this uh, record from this this is the dvp get record this return uh, details as a data set so you can check it here this simply contain one process and the uh, records that fills it to the uh, data set and then return that uh, data set And now it's mm, taking a uh, where stream is equal to new memory stream, new memory stream, and then we use using using this uh, where package is equal to new. Excel package for uh, using this Excel package we need to add uh, one more new get packages for this I am using here uh, EP plus so I am pressing control dot so this showing uh, intelligence for uh, installing this uh, EP plus packages so click on this Now AP plus is installed and uh, this also adding one more namespace for uh, office open XML and this dependency is also added here in inside this uh, package it's uh, AP plus 6.1 so uh, this will contain uh, one input parameters for this so I am using for this stream and then uh, we creating one worksheet worksheet is called to package dot workbook dot worksheets and then uh, works dot add here we add a worksheet for this and here we adding a one worksheet name is like seat one and then uh, worksheet dot cell dot cells dot code uh, load from data table so because here we fetching the record from data table so it's a ds dot table zero because this container data table at a zero level then it's a print headers so here yeah, mind printing this as a true and then it's a worksheet dot cells for auto fit here i am adding uh, auto fit auto fit columns for zero positions so they are the position number and then uh, we firstly set a header header text so worksheet dot header header footer and uh, then it's like a odd header 
dot center text yet i am setting a one center text for this like i am setting one center text for like a employee data with 24 font size so i am setting as a 24 and uh, and then we set like uh, this as an underline so it's a u then end and then it's a slash and then it's a area like we we can also set here a, a font name it's like Arial and then regular so bold we set as a bold and then it's employee data it's header name now i am adding a a, a footer text so it's worksheet dot uh, header footer dot uh, odd footer so we can set like a page number so dot uh, it's a uh, alignment like uh, I'm setting this at uh, uh, right alignment so equal to string dot format and here like I'm setting uh, page page zero position zero of one and then here we provide a value for that numbers it's like excel excel uh, header foot dot uh, dot of page number and then it's a uh, total number of pages it's uh, excel excel header footer dot uh, number of pages and then uh, we set the uh, seat name also we can set also it's seat seat name it's work set dot uh, header footer dot or footer dot it's like uh, setting this as a left alignment text so it's equal to excel header footer dot uh, uh, like a, a seat name it's excel dot uh, seat name and and in footer we can also uh, set like a file path and a file name so i am adding one more line for this um, dot header footer dot odd footer dot odd footer dot left alignment text we can set uh, different text on different alignments like i am set this in center this will be good for seat name into the center text i am set this as a left alignment so excel header footer dot file path and then it's uh, excel header footer dot file name And then uh, for changing the Excel layout view, so I'm making this code for this worksheet dot view. We change the view of the page layout, so it's a page layout view. It's equal to true. This will change the uh, uh, view as a printing mode. And then we save that package. Dot save. now uh, we set the positions and the stream dot position is equal to zero and then string dot like i'm setting excel file name 
like x name is equal to your employee uh, data dot uh, xlsx you can uh, set this name as a dynamic for whatever purpose i am using this name as a hard coded then we return file and firstly i am returning this a stream and then uh, its content type so i am writing this application slash vnd its content type dot open xml format formats formats then office document documents dot spreadsheet spreadsheet dot uh, sheet and then uh, we set this uh, excel name file name i think something mistake here it's a uh, spreadsheet ml uh, dot dot uh, sheet so now uh, we added a button for uh, calling this method so i am adding it here like uh, it's a uh, export excel and then here we writing the method for this it's uh, home and then uh, our method name or method name is export excel so write it is here now uh, we run this application so i am pressing ctrl f5 to debugging this application so click on export excel is calling that method and generating the excel i think header is missing here and photo is already added so this is the like a uh, file path and this is a seat name and it's total number of pages and uh, current page so i think something missing in header code so we'll check this i think we by mistake i am writing here it's uh, odd footer it's here needs uh, to be add odd header so again run this application and again depress this page and click on export x now again exporting the data to the excel format so now uh, that it is coming that we write it here it's a employee data and now this come to here so this all the contains the header and the footers as you required so this also contain in printable format so is the uh you can set a print command for that excel data so this is a complete code for how you can export excel with uh, header and footer footer record so if you have any questions any problems please write in the comment box i will reply you soon and if you like my videos please click on subscribe button and for getting a latest update also click on notification bell so thanks thanks for watching we will meet in next video session